What's going on, everybody? Welcome back to another episode of the Pokemon Legends Arceus Let's Play. In the previous episode, we completed the last challenge for the Red Chain, and now we are told that we are heading to Mount Cornet, which I am super excited for. But before we uh, go ahead and do that, I'm going to make sure I talk to... Uh, I don't know who what her name is, but... I want to talk to someone. I don't remember your name. I think it's this lady here. Because she should have what we're looking for, which is a razor claw. And the reason why I want a razor claw is because with this here razor claw, we can now get ourselves a Sneasler which is very, very exciting. Uh, let me just do this. Uh, not, not quite what I'm looking for there. Um, do we not have better? I found a f I found a PNG for suing and sneasel so much easier, but I can't find one for Sneasler, really? I spelled it right. Yeah, I spelled it right. I don't know why it's not popping up with more than what it's got. Um, I guess we'll just leave. We'll just leave a sneeze on the layout. I guess. But I am gonna evolve it into a sneezler. I guess what I should do is I should check if I spelled this correctly or not. D C. I don't. I don't think I spelled deceiving right. But we got ourselves a sneezler. I did not smell deceiving right either. I can see that. So this, this, this. Boom, boom, and boom. Yes, that's, that's what it is. All right, let's take a look. Let's take a look at Sneasler here. Fighting and poison type, of course. Um, can we get any? Can we get any new moves by chance? Because we evolved. Dire Claw. Aiming the Atlantic crit may lead the target poison paralyzed or drowsy. That is probably going to be better than Poison Jab. Even though Poison Jab is base 80, this gives me a good chance to get some status inflictions, so I'm super okay with that. Also, it's going to be easier if I do it like this. Just teleport over the front gate, because I can't use Ride Pokemon over here. There you are, Tristan. Arita's already headed to Mount Cornet. How are things looking here? Commander is already at Mount Cornet. He's already started up the mountain. He must be more reckless than, dig than that dignified manner of his let on. Not that I can blame anyone for wanting to avoid wasting time. Well, all right, then. I guess I'm going after him. Well, let me go first, Tristan. If we're to show up with no warning, then there'd probably be a fight. Time's a-wasting. See you there. I bet we fight the commander. Hmm. Who is the reckless one? Hey, you gotta run out of the village, right? But you still tried to find a way to help us all? That's right. Tristan worked hard to get that red chain to help us. Too right. And a fine job he did, too. The survey corpse is always hard at work for the sake of everyone here in the village as well 
as for the sake of our relations with Pokemon. Thanks. Here, take this. Actually, can you use that now? Because I'm not doing a Nuzlocke anymore. And she ran away. She said, Screw you, Dad. I'm going home. Your orders are three. One, make for the summit camp. From there, the Temple of Sinnoh. Two, use the red chain to resolve this mess. And three, return here alive. I've heard the latest, so you've been accepted back into the galaxy team, have you? I suppose congratulations are in order. Here, some max potions for me to celebrate. Max HP. It looks like the big moment is upon us at last. But no doubt, it'll be fine. After all, you worked so hard to earn that red chain. Both Adaman and Aria have headed to the peak as well. My good friend Tristan, I wish you great fortune in the battles to come. I would truly regret losing one of our most beloved and loyal customers. It seems Kamado in intends to use the summit camp as a base of operations for his undertaking. And as for me, I think I'll set up a shop closer to the temple itself. Things certainly seem to have gotten out of hand. Well, if anything goes wrong, the great Melee will be here, for moral support at least. Oh shit, there's a lot of satchels. Did I not get any of the satchels here? Unless they, they just spawn more. That could be possible. I'm gonna move some of the things that I don't want to lose into the storage. Like that. Like a lot of the craftable things. Um, hold on, let me see. Do you have, do you have stuff I can buy? My hyper potions. Great balls wouldn't hurt either. I'm gonna buy 10 of these, and then I'm gonna buy 14 of those. Now I'm gonna buy four more of these, because I just realized I'm at an odd number for those. Um, and I guess I should buy some revives. I wouldn't, it wouldn't be a bad shot, especially because we're not nuzlocking this game anymore, but let's go ahead and get a move on. Electabuzz. Another Electabuzz. Another Electabuzz. That's probably a Totem Electivire. Yes, it definitely is. I'm flying over his bitch ass. Not interested in these games with you today. stone portal I've been told not to let anyone pass but I'm really I'm not sure what's the point in and what the point is any longer think you could go ask for me something's gonna happen in here Oh, still alive and kicking? Sorry to have uh, shuttered the wallflower. I'd much rather be there now, serving up some freshly grilled potato mochi. But the taskmaster Kamado has gone and left me to oversee our food supply, and he always finds a way to put these old bones to work. 
While I'm handling that, I suppose I'll handle you as well. Time we got rid of you once and for all. I knew something was up with this dude. I'll make myself plan. As Kamado's right hand, I'm charged with executing all the gritty deeds Kamado can't or won't do himself. I gave him my word, and I'll get rid of any fools that might dream of getting in the way of his plans. And besides, it's not just Kamado who longs to live in a new home free of fear or strife. His dream is mine now, too. You've seen my smoke bombs before, right? Well, this is how you're meant to use them. What the fuck? When I heard you managed to call those nobles one after another, uh, oh, did it ever make my blood run hot and my heart pound? And at last, at last. One final opponent worthy of my great ninja techniques that have been left to molder all these long years. Okay. Miss Magius. What level are we looking at? 59? Oh, sick. Okay, uh... I mean, we one-shot the Zoroark, right? So, I'm assuming we could... Come on, man. I can assume we are gonna one-shot Miss Magius here, but... We also have the Mook. This is exactly why right here I don't want to Nuzlocke this game anymore. I could have easily killed that Miss Magius in two hits, but it just didn't give me a fucking chance to do it. Um, Power Gem is a problem. Power Gem is a problem. Is that super effective against you? It's not super effective against you, but I can't really do much with you. Super effective against Deputy. Um, I might go to Weird Ear. You can't attack me with any ghost moves, so that's kind of the reason why I want to do this. Hypnosis. Yeah, you don't like how that feels, huh? I'm gonna side shield bash this thing. Oh my god, that damage. Good stuff. See, that just further proves too that a super effective move from my Samurai would have knocked that thing out. Would have just further proved that. Oh, nice. I'm glad you get to move two turns in a row. Oh my god. And you fought off drowsiness. Must be nice. Yeah. Eat shit. Die. Take off my boots, my feet are killing me right now. Sneezler? Oh, I'm gonna get out of bed and die. That would've been nice to know. That would've been nice to know that you're gonna send this thing out, coward. Um, high horsepower. I'd aerial ace it. I could aerial ace this thing. That would be a would be pretty valid, wouldn't it? Can I? Is it, is this gonna be possible? It is possible. I can agile style a double hit, and then what I'm gonna do is I'm going to take this turn and I'm going to wrong style aerial ace because this should power me up like. So, so high. Yeah. Fuck out. Fuck out of here. What's next? Is he gonna get two hits off? Oh yeah. Seen that coming. 
But with him getting those two hits off, I can come in with... I could probably come in with Sneasler here. Dire Claw this... Ooh. I don't know, actually. I can do this, actually. I can Agile Style Dire Claw. Guarantee I get a hit off on this thing. Maybe get a status effect. And then I could Strong Style at the next turn. Because Strong Style basically kind of doubles, almost. It almost doubles Agile Style, so yeah, we were good there. Gallade. Okay, Gallade. How the hell am I going to deal with this thing? How am I going to deal with this thing? Um... It doesn't matter here. I could flame wheel, or I could double hit. I'm gonna double hit on the off chance. Okay, we take the hit, good. We didn't do any damage to him either. I'm just gonna risk. Is this worth the risk, actually? Can I get the burn? Oh, that's gonna be enough HP though. And since I strong styled, he's gonna he's gonna be able to kill my mammal swine here, isn't he? He's not. I almost don't want to risk the high horsepower. Or you know what, actually? Fuck this guy. I'm gonna max revive. I'm just gonna max revive someone. Although he could, actually no, I'm not gonna do that. Cause he can drain punch me. So, I can catch that. Come on, Manny, come through. Let's go, we got a crit too. Fuck you, Benny. You thought you were going to beat my ass. Wrong. It seems my ninja techniques will s soon be co-signed, consigned to history. Really? He was the only one that got the experience? I killed other mons with other mons on my team. Just because they died doesn't mean they shouldn't get experience. Very good, young one. Very good indeed. It's only a foolish ninja who tries to keep a after a target they know they cannot beat. And to be honest, I don't hate you. Might actually like you after a fashion, at least for the skill you show in battle. But listen, tr well, Tristan, Pokemon truly are terrifying creatures. Kamado and I saw our hometown burned to the ground by a maddening Pokemon running amok. We lost plenty of friends and comrades that day. That's why Kamado came here to Hisui to try and build a new home where people could live free from fear. But to achieve something truly great, you sometimes have to take extreme actions. If hypothetical as it may be, a Pokemon were to appear from the within the space-time rip, Kamado might lose hold of his reason. Save Kamado from himself by force if you must. Do that, and I'll stuff you full of more delicious potato mochi than a human stomach can handle. Okay, he healed me up at least. I was gonna say, if you don't heal me up, you're you're an ass. Is that Volo? Well, what is that? Have you bought everything you need? Oh, I'm glad max potions were here. Full restores, too? Uh. 
Um, what do these seeds of mastery do? Master moves so it can be used in an agile or strong style. Would it be foolish for me to sell those right now? I'll probably wait until we do streams. That way I can gauge that judgment a bit better. You've brought the red chain. Tristan, you're the only one who can stop whatever is unfolding at the top of the mountain. That Pokemon that apparently has been sighted through the rift? I think I think it may be the Almighty Sinnoh, but Commander Kamado stopped us from heading towards the temple. Well, let's see what this is. You again. I've heard that this red chain of yours will bind the world. I assume to bind the world means to hold the world together, keeping it as it's meant to be. A welcome idea, but I can truly put my faith in such tales. What? Do you think even the red chain is some trick on Tristan's part? He worked mightily to get that thing, and I should know, I was with him the whole time. I saw him rise to the trials set by the three Pokemon of the lakes. If he somehow concocted all of this on his own, then what hope do we even have anyway? Perhaps you're right. But if I were simply to put my faith in this boy, and the faith were to be betrayed, then how could I possibly face my people? Then work together with us. Should something go wrong, I'll take complete responsibility. Fine. Enough. Let fate decide what happens next. Whichever of us is stronger will prevail. Face me with your Pokemon, Tristan. Today we battle in earnest. How many you got? You got four as well? All right. Braviary. Ooh. This is actually kind of scary. I don't know what typing he is outside of flying. That's gonna kill me, isn't it? It doesn't. What is Braviary? Psychic and flying. Alright, I'm probably, probably gonna guess that based on of how he looks. But I'm not gonna bother with that. What I will do, though, is I'm gonna take this turn to Aqua Jet this thing. Get some chip damage off, and this allows me to go another turn. I'm gonna ceaseless edge this thing, but the problem is, do I want to strong style this thing? If I strong style it, I'm fairly confident I can kill. However, I think whatever comes in next is gonna get a free hit off on me, so. I mean, fuck it, if, it's, if this takes one, one mod out, I don't care. Oh, it was so close. Max Potion. He couldn't have missed the Air Slash. Come on now. He got a crit too. Did I just see that right? He got a crit. You couldn't. First of all, you couldn't have missed an Air Slash, but secondly, you had to get a crit. Whack. Whack as fuck. Alright, Deputy. I got two turns with this thing. And... Nah, I just aerialized here. I don't risk the chance of missing. What are you bringing now? Golem? Huh? Fuck. Samurai would be perfect here. Samurott would be perfect here. I don't have him out there. I don't have him alive, though. I'm gonna take the risk here. I'm gonna send out the shiny Rapidash. I'm gonna max revive our... 
uh, Samurott here. Because Golem? Golem really won't be able to do anything to me. I mean, he can... Oh, he's Agile styling. Rock Slide. Is he gonna get another turn to attack me? He might get another turn to attack me. He did. He got Stealth Rocks, too. Okay, so here's what I'm thinking. Okay, it doesn't... I have to Agile style Aqua Jet this thing. But the good thing about... such a thing is that I can get two turns to attack this thing. I mean, Water Pulse probably would have one-shot him anyways. Probably would have one-shot him anyways, so I don't know why I did that. Snorlax, okay. I mean, he's gonna kill me here. Level 62, by the way. Level 62, by the way. Um... Oh, I get two turns... No. No. I get two turns no matter what. Oh, fuck this thing. Fuck this thing. You're dead. I'm dead, aren't I? Yep. That sucks, though, because I know I need my... I know I need Sneasler around for this Clefable. I know that I'm going to need Sneasler around for that Clefable. I'm going to Hypnosis this thing. I mit... Ah, uh, dude, really? I missed again, bro. This game's throwing. I'm, I'm, I'm not, I'm not even kidding. This game is throwing. Online baby doll eyes. Still nothing. I need it to be drowsy. Just so that way it has a chance of missing attacks. Thank you. And it's offensive and defensive stats went down. Good. So I'm gonna revive Sneasler here. If I can get another... I was gonna say, if I could get another sleep turn, that would've been nice, but I don't think we're gonna... I think it's gonna shake off sleep. Does it? Okay. I guess what I can do is I could just chip this thing away, kind of give myself... Kind of give myself the room to... Okay. It's already full health, though. Now, if I swap to... If I swap to my Sneasler here, do I get two turns? I do get two turns. I can get three turns? Why do I get three turns? I better not be getting played with this. I, I wasn't getting played with it. Okay. Sick. Fuck out. Any Pokemon that threatens our life here must be eliminated. 
Good stuff. I still think my entire team that, you know, killed Mons should get experience, but, you know, whatever. You're truly a force to be reckoned with. Tristan, the fates have decided. I concede, and I apologize sincerely for doubting you. Commander, I know I have no right to ask you, ask it of you any longer, but please use the strength of yours for the sake of the Galaxy Expedition Team. No, for the sake of the Celestica people and all the Pokemon living in Hisui. Heal me up and I got you, Chief. Don't worry, Commander, we've got the red chain. All right, we got healed up. So I'm gonna go ahead and wrap up this video here. If you guys enjoyed, make sure you hit that like button down below because it'd be greatly appreciated. Next episode, we're gonna see what happens. I don't quite know what is going on, but cannot deny this is exciting. It is very exciting. Uh, if you don't wanna miss out on the next episode, make sure you hit that like button down below because it'd be greatly appreciated. Uh, subscribe as well. Make sure you uh, click the bell icon. Um, if you want to follow my socials, such as my Twitter or my TikTok, both of those are going to be linked in the description below. Anyways, I'm going to get out of here. Have yourselves a great day, and peace.